Day weekend upon us. A lot of Americans are thinking about hitting the road, but there's a good chance your travel plans have been canceled. KCTV 5 Neil Jones has tonight's top five. This pandemic has made it tough to travel, but that could be a good thing if it gets you out of traveling to places you don't want to go. You married people know what I'm talking about. So here are my top five places to avoid. Number five, Arkansas. This state's like an addict who looks like Miss America. It's gorgeous, but pure trouble. It gave us Bill Clinton and John Daly. Now Little Rock's known for its great truck stops. And I guess that's something. They used to have the slogan, Land of Opportunity, on their license plates. But that was so obviously false that they've changed it to better than Mississippi. Which is true. Every year, a ton of Kansas City area kids go down to the University of Arkansas to get a cheap education. Four years later, they come back with a cheap education and a knowledge of how to call the hogs. Hey, Let's face it, Arkansas has great people and bad teeth. Number four, Canada. Canada was our ally in two world wars. While I don't speak Canadian, the four or five Canadians I've met have been really nice. But any country that views Minnesota and Wisconsin as the Sun Belt is way too cold. And I bet it would be easy to do the weather up there. Every day, show up late to work and just predict snow and ice. To many, it's a beautiful, unspoiled paradise. But to me, Canada is just too cold. Number three, Los Angeles. The instant you get there, you smell the carbon monoxide. Every second you're there, you know you're dying a little faster. The traffic is terrible, and why not? LA's population is four million. There's lots of famous beaches there, all of which are overrun with people. Now, I did cover the 1984 Olympic Games there, and it was fun. Wait, how old is Neil? Number two, Kentucky. How backward is Kentucky? Well, they don't even realize how bad it is. When you cover Kentucky basketball, you can be sure of two things. Fans whining about the referees, and nowhere to eat after the game. We asked where we could get a good steak, and we were told Waffle House. I love Waffle House. In fact, I wanted to have our wedding reception there. But for steak? How bad is it there? Well, the most popular city is Cincinnati. Which isn't even in Kentucky. That pretty much says it all. And that brings us to number one, Honduras. It boasts gorgeous beaches, unbelievable Mayan ruins, and the world's highest murder rate. Now that sounds a lot like St. Louis. What? St. Louis does have America's highest murder rate. Johnson Countyans are forever looking for exotic places to vacation, but even they're not dumb enough to go there. Or are they? Well, cheap prices and the world's second largest barrier reef are attracting a lot of attention, but then so's the country's reputation for gun running and human trafficking. Although to be fair, the soccer riots are great. Now beauty's in the eye of the beholder, but those are the top five places I want to avoid.